Hello everybody, today I'll be doing a video series on getting unlocking your bootloader for your HTC Resound and then installing a custom recovery and putting ice cream sandwich on it. This is a stock HTC Resound. You can see it in the about phone section. Little phone identity. There you go. Um, doesn't have root. Uh, no super user app. Anyways, first thing you're going to do, go to htcdev.com and you'll actually need to make an account if you don't already have one. Really easy to do, just fill in all that information. I'm going to go ahead and log in to mine. Okay. Now, click unlock bootloader. Get started. Select your device, HTC Resound. Yes. Proceed to unlock instructions. Check both those boxes. All right. First thing you're going to have to do is completely power off your phone. and then remove the case. This case can be kind of tricky to remove. You just put your finger in that little groove right on the bottom and pry off the back case. You might have to pry a little harder than you want to, but I promise you it won't break. I've done this like 40 times. And have to set the camera down to use with both hands. Okay, there's the phone, there's the case. And remove the battery, just like the website says. Put it back in. And now push your volume down and power at the same time. Holding volume down and power after you push them. All right, this is your bootloader. As you can see right now, it says locked. That's what we're going to fix. Uh, keep following the instructions on the HTC dev site. So highlight fastboot and press power. Now connect your phone via USB. Okay, next page. You want to download these three files that HTC provides for you. Get the Windows package here and step by step follow what they do. Open up command prompt, change to the directory that you downloaded those files in. And once you do that, you'll be able to type fastboot and get a response like I just did. So next step, type exactly what they have for you. So copy it, move over to command prompt, paste it in. Now you get this block of text, right click and select mark and start right there. You have to have the identifier token start section and end section, but make sure you don't, ha <clears throat> don't have that parentheses bootloader stuff. Push enter to copy it. Scroll down to the bottom and paste it in this block. Then hit submit. All right, pretty soon I'll be getting an email. Here it is. With the file I need to unlock the phone. Download the attachment they sent you and click the link to finish unlocking it. Now, hopefully you didn't do anything with your phone. You can just leave it in the state it's in now change your command prompt directory to wherever that unlock code is, or you can move the unlock code into the directory where fastboot is and copy what they gave you once again. Paste. 
Now, as you can see, the phone is asking you if you want to unlock the bootloader. Simply push the volume up button to select yes, and you will push the power button. Now, just a warning, pushing power will erase all your user data, uh, text messages, phone calls, apps. Um, you should be synced with the Google market though, so all of those will restore once you log in. Press the power button now. All right, right back into the bootloader because I was holding down there. As you can see, it's scanning, or it was scanning to see if there are any packages it could install because it is unlocked. You can now do what you want. If you had any problems, go ahead and leave a comment. I'll do my best to help you. Thanks for watching.